Hi everybody, um, I'm making a video to show you this wheel that I got. It's a 500 watt from that company, eBikeLink. They, I had a question one day and they answer fast, so the, the company seems to be good, but it just this didn't work for me. It stopped working, uh, it, it probably it's not strong enough or something happened. Uh, it's a front wheel kit. I usually have rear wheel kit, uh, so I'm thank God I can return it. Uh, so I took it apart. I didn't use this tire because um, the tires that come with it, I, uh, I with with these kits, uh, it, they're just not strong enough. Um, so I just bought a different tire. So let me see if I can pause it instead of stopping it, and I'm gonna go outside. Okay, I'm outside now, and this is what I made, and it goes on on the bike. Like, let's see, this is not a this is not the bike I was using, but it goes on a bike like this. Well, it, now it doesn't go because it's got the screw there, but basically it goes like that and you can put a bunch of batteries on it and the connections i made is well these are not connected this just wired here and there and they are all connected in using a 12 gauge wire you have to have good connections or else these things that i got from ebay uh they hold the battery right and but you have to have a good connection or else the the wire will melt because like what happens is like if these two are to become disconnected then you're gonna have more power running through the other side and also they get uh, corrosion because this gets wet with with the rain the water comes in through here and hits a the, in there so the ones that were connected were getting a lot of water on them uh, so here's the connection is like you connect all the red ones together and all the black ones together that's but that's a parallel connection uh, right so this would be the hot black or, uh, this wire is not part of this. So I guess you can pause it and watch in slow motion or whatever, so you can see how they are connected. Uh, we got these are not connected, so don't get confused. And I'm gonna pause the video again and I'm gonna show you the the batteries and the bike. So this is my uh, bike. I had to replace this the fork because uh, when I hit a bump the drinks will fall I take coffees and things like that and I had a lot of problems with spillings okay. and this thing was here like that no actually it was in the bottom one on the bottom side right there I should have taken the screw out let me pause it and take it out so there it is. It goes here, but uh, you can put. I was. It was actually here all the way up, right? And uh, with the bolt, it, this doesn't move anymore. Um, I also wrapped uh, an old tire tube around this one so it doesn't scratch it. Although I don't care about this bike, but I put it there for uh, shock proof or whatever, right? Uh, and that connects to your things. Oh, this is this goes from uh, 36 volt converts to 12 volts for the for the light. Uh, what else? Uh, I don't know. I always recommend these brakes. Uh, they last a lot longer. Any breaks? I, I made another video about it somewhere. Uh, 
Okay. All right, sorry, I had to pause it. Uh, so, uh, yeah, and I have uh, hydraulic brakes. I put that because these brakes, uh, and actually I never put that on the front, but probably it could have worked. Uh, you can also have a double cable uh, uh, brake and have a combination of this type of brake like this and a cable uh, 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 this brake cable and when you do that you can uh, it was recommended by my by the uh, bike shop to put it but I never I never use this type of so brakes here uh, with this uh, fork oh. and I bought this bar too which is cheap, but it is, doesn't hold tight. You have to clamp it down. So I put these clamps to hold it because basically, uh, for some reason, it, it, it just doesn't work. It, it's not right, but it's very cheap, so it's good. Uh, fine, it works like that. Uh, oh yeah, I think I was talking about this. This uh, thing, you can find it on eBay or Amazon. And it converts the the voltage from the batteries, which is high, and lowers it down to 12 volts for for a light. And this is a light that I got. That's from uh, somebody gave it to me. It's it's LED. And eventually, I'm gonna put a cigarette lighter uh, so I can plug and charge my phone. And I'm gonna put a horn on it. So everything is 12 volts, so all that will run with those batteries. And I'm going to show you the batteries. I don't put a battery here right now because it's, it will be live and it's not connected and it will cost a short. So you don't do that until it's all plugged in. So the batteries are here, the, the charge. Just come in and put them. Uh, I used two minimum at the time. I just go in there and slide them through, and boom, and they stay there. Uh, like like I was saying on the text that I wrote uh, on an, on another video, is that uh, this battery is charged in three hours, so you have you have uh, like four chargers charging at the same time so in three hours i i can go i have six charging right and i can go use another uh no i'm sorry i have eight charging with eight chargers while i go and use four for them for two hours or three hours when i come back one set is already charged and then i go uh, and leaves this charging and I come back in another three hours and I have another set charged because I go and do deliveries uh, so I always have batteries when when you have the once it takes six hours to charge it, you can't it just doesn't work you have to have you have to have four of them to be able to do that so this uh, it, this is more expensive, but also you can drop it. I can throw it on the floor and it's not gonna break. And, and they're sealed. Water does not get in here at all. No problem, no issues with the water with this battery. So, and also if you buy them new, they're 100 and, I got them on sale for 120 and they have three year warranty. Um, while the other ones I have no idea those packs that you buy that go here, uh, you know, the black packs, there are 52 volts, 13 amp hours. They don't, uh, I don't know if they have warranty or not. They, they, they go bad, they don't last too long. And this one's lasted a long time. Um, but I got this, I got some of them. Most of them I got them used from eBay for 80 bucks each. 
so that's a good deal. They also have ones that are six amp hours, but you have to have them all the same or else it doesn't work. They're a little bit taller, and that will give you an extra mile. This gives me six miles each, right? So if I put four, I get 26 miles. Um, and like I said, the big advantage is that it's waterproof, it has warranty, and it charges in half the time. Um, what else I was gonna say? Oh yeah, so a six ampere, six amp power will give you 10% more distance. So it'll probably give you seven miles uh, times four, uh, 28 miles, uh, but it'll pay you a little bit more. I think it's worth it to get six amp hours. And um, yeah, all right, so that's it, uh, or else my video is gonna be way too long. Is there anything I'm just looking at? Yeah. Uh, that's it. This bike I found. <laughs> this frame I found. Somebody got rid of it. Uh, so it's got a regular wheel. The, the wheel that I ordered is going to go in the back. I borrowed this wheel from another bike. It's going to go back to it. This is the tires that I use. Um, uh, they are hook worms. They have a liner inside that is called toffee. Or else you're going to get nails and you're going to have flats and you're going to be far away and... Uh, it's not nice. Uh, uh, this will last. It will take glass. It, will, it never. I never had a. Uh, you can drive over the glass with that. Of course, because it's got the liner inside. It's called toffee, and you have to get the widest one that you can get. Because you can get, you can get a nail on here, <clears throat> and it go through. Because the toffee thing is not too wide. It's about this wide. <clears throat> I'm losing my voice now. I just woke up. <clears throat> Um, all right, so this is going back in. I'm gonna rebuild it so that <clears throat> I'm gonna cut this wood here. Well, actually, I'm gonna replace this wood. I'm gonna cut this wood here and here. So this will be able to go and stick out all the way here. So I'll have the batteries here. I may be able to get fancy and put an angle on it, but I don't need to do that. So, so I'll have a battery here and a battery here on the front. This will give me more space for pedaling uh, and for space for putting my knees. Uh, and we'll see, so that'll be in the future. I'm gonna, I'm working on, I'm gonna work on that on this week, but I have to find the a box to return the other one. And that's more of a priority because I don't have a lot of time to return it. All right, so there it is. And if you look in my videos, I believe I have, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna see if I have a picture of it right now. I'm gonna pause this one. 